In recent years, hyper-realistic humanoid dolls have ceased to be simple display objects and become an advanced manifestation of technology and art. These creations, popularly known as dolls, not only imitate the human form, but replicate it with such a minute level of detail that in some cases they are indistinguishable from a real person. Their emergence marks a significant shift in the way humans relate to machines. It is no longer just about functionality, but also about presence, aesthetics, and emotional connection. Far from being children's toys, these dolls represent a new type of artificial companion carefully designed to interact, excite, and in some cases even accompany. Thus begins a new era in the history of social robotics, one where realism without clear boundaries. The secret behind the striking realism of these dolls lies in the combination of advanced technology and precise artisanal techniques. The skin is made of high-quality medical silicone, capable of imitating not only the texture but also the elasticity and temperature of a human body. The eyes, made of glass or acrylic, possess a shine and depth that reflect light just like a real eye. Each hair is manually implanted one by one to create a natural, personalized appearance. In addition, the face receives an artistic treatment, with makeup using eyeshadow, blush, applied eyelashes, and lips colored with surgical precision. These elements are not added randomly, but follow real anatomical and aesthetic patterns. Thus, the external appearance becomes an almost perfect illusion, reinforcing the sense of human presence that these dolls seek to convey from the first glance. Beyond visual realism, what truly brings these dolls to life is their ability to move and express themselves. Thanks to an internal system of joints designed with biomechanical precision, the most advanced models can adopt natural postures, bend joints smoothly, and maintain balance just as a human body would. In the facial area, hidden micromotors enable subtle movements, blinking, smiling, eyebrow tilts, and lip movements coordinated with speech. These expressions are not mere embellishments. They are part of a strategy to generate empathy and respond emotionally to the environment. All of this is designed so that interaction with the doll is not perceived as rigid or robotic, but rather fluid and human. Thus, movement becomes a key element in reinforcing the illusion of humanity, which began with physical appearance and now comes to life with gestures and expression. The incorporation of artificial intelligence marks a qualitative leap in the evolution of these dolls. Models like Harmony developed by Avis Creations, are capable of holding coherent conversations, remembering the user's personal data, and adapting their tone and responses according to the emotional context. This capability is not limited to programmed phrases. They use natural language processing to interpret intentions, emotions, and even the mood of the person interacting with them. Through an intuitive interface, the user can configure personality aspects such as the level of affection, mood, or response style. Some even learn over time, adjusting their behavior based on observed preferences. This constant and personalized interaction not only creates an immersive experience but also strengthens the emotional bond with the user. In this way, AI transforms the doll into something more than a physical replica, into a truly lifelike presence. The growth of the humanoid doll market has given rise to a variety of brands, each with its own unique approaches and technologies. BW Doll, for example, stands out for its obsession with hyper-realism. Every detail, from pores to surface veins, is carefully sculpted. RZR Doll, with its R-Series line, focuses on highly functional joints that allow for smooth movements and natural poses, ideal for visual artists and collectors. Jeff Aim, on the other hand, offers excellent value for money, democratizing access to this technology. Ellen, the artificial human technology, stands out for its dynamic facial expressions and realistic eyes. Shinkin 165 introduces makeup and hairstyles that vary with expression. Peach Crisis and Andy Eva specialize in soft textures and aesthetic customization. Finally, Harmony combines a realistic body with advanced artificial intelligence, marking a fusion between the physical and the digital. Each model represents a distinct vision of the future of the artificial company. Although these dolls appear to be just a technological curiosity, their applications go far beyond simple fun. One of the most prominent uses is emotional companionship. People experiencing loneliness or isolation find in them a form of emotional connection. Some also play an important role in psychological therapy, helping to treat disorders such as depression or anxiety by providing patients with a figure with whom they can safely interact. In the field of interpersonal relationships, these dolls can serve as simulations of human interactions, allowing the exploration of emotional dynamics in a controlled environment. Furthermore, they are tools in scientific research on human behavior and robotics. 
Finally, in the world of art and collectibles, their meticulous design and high degree of customization make them valuable pieces for artists and collectors interested in exploring the interaction between humans and artificial beings. One of the most fascinating features of humanoid dolls is their level of customization. Users can customize almost every aspect of the doll, from its physical appearance to its personality. This includes hair color and style, eye shape, and even skin tones and makeup. Furthermore, it is possible to modify the voice by adjusting its pitch, rhythm, and accent to create a more intimate and personalized interaction. The most advanced aspect is the ability to configure behavior and emotional responses, creating a doll that not only reflects the user's physical preferences but also adapts to their emotional and psychological desires, becoming a virtual mirror of their ideals and needs. The development of humanoid dolls is a global phenomenon, with different regions leading the way in innovation based on their cultural contexts. Japan has been a pioneer in the creation of humanoid robots, focusing on the harmony between the human and the artificial, seeking to create robots that complement everyday life. China, meanwhile, leads in production and accessibility, combining technological advances with high manufacturing capacity. In E2, technology focuses more on customization and interactivity with an emphasis on artificial intelligence to create unique experiences. Finally, Europe stands out for its ethical and aesthetic considerations, seeking to balance technological functionality with respect for social norms. Cultural differences not only affect the design but also how these dolls are perceived and accepted socially. The emotional attachment to humanoid dolls raises complex questions about their psychological and social impact. On the one hand, they can foster isolation, as those emotionally dependent on these artificial figures may withdraw from real human interactions, favoring a one-way relationship. This situation could lead to the replacement of human bonds, causing people to prioritize connections with objects over social interactions. However, there is also significant therapeutic potential, especially for those suffering from loneliness or affective disorders such as depression or anxiety. In these cases, dolls can offer a safe and controlled form of companionship providing emotional comfort and aiding in healing processes. This double-edged sword between benefits and risks underscores the need for deeper ethical reflection on their use. The advancement of humanoid dolls raises important ethical dilemmas. Are we humanizing machines too much? By designing them to simulate human emotions, behaviors, and bonds, we are blurring the distinction between the real and the artificial. Furthermore, it raises the question of whether an artificial relationship can replace real love or companionship. If dolls provide emotional comfort to those who need them, to what extent can we consider them a healthy solution? The challenge lies in finding a balance between technological progress and preserving human emotional authenticity, without machines replacing genuine bonds between people. If you found this content interesting, click the bell to receive notifications of our upcoming videos on technology, innovation, and more. Leave your comment below and share your opinion. What do you think about humanoid dolls? Do you think they could change the way we relate to each other? We want to hear your opinion.